Hi, this is Playmobello, and that is a tactical unit vehicle. This was released in the year 2022. Look at that. At the top, it lights up. Comes with two heavily armored and protected police officers. It does say police on that, so they are enforced police officers. It looks really awesome. It has one of the coolest tires that I have seen in a Playmobil car. I hope you can see that through this camera here. But the tires are the best. Rotate so smoothly. Look at that. But the tires are very, very soft. It's a hollow rubber. When you drop them on the floor here, they bounce. Look at that. It bounces really good. And because of that, it feels like it has suspension. But it's just the tire. It's very soft and nice to push around. So these are the two police officers that you get with a car. The lights also stay on for a while. They don't go off too fast. The rifle here looks really cool. It's tactical and it looks like a looks like a police rifle or a shotgun. But I don't understand why the holder of the rifle is on the side like that. I don't know why it's not down here. So when you hold it, 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 it looks more realistic because if you look from this side why is he holding the rifle like that you know what i mean it, you can hold from the back here nobody shoots like that you can also hold it at the top here sideways at the top it looks a little bit better but then if you look at the top the rifle is sideways and then there's the other problem that the hands of the Playmobil are not holding these very nicely. It's literally loose on the hand. I love how these officers are armored. This one has a glass shield, bulletproof possibly. This one has a radio, a microphone on his face. And they both have a face mask. Look at that. Their identity needs to be hidden as best as possible. So Playmobil observed that and gave them all of the gear that these officers also have in real life. There is a pistol on each of these guys here. Long enforcement issue pistol they both have awesome gloves as well they are not the same they're different each character has a different kind of glove vest bulletproof vest back and front that is the box Oops. so this is the box it's a promo pack set 71003 from playmobil it's a police unit it shows the two characters in the back here and here on the side you see accessories you would also have here it is a quick comparison of the police tactical unit truck with the cooper the mini cooper and a beetle so you can see they're all realistically properly sized their tires the doors the cabin everything looks pretty good and here's a comparison of two police vehicles one a sports police car and this is the tactical unit the engine in the front does not open even though it has this little crevice here that looks like you can hold with your finger and push it open you do not get access to the engine the door does not open playmobil has not made cars that have these doors open at all the only one that i know so far is the delorean and maybe some of the most recent cars being released there is a light at the top an antenna right here for the transmission of radios and receivers then there are some small little windows just like in any tactical unit from the police force pm for playmobil 22 is the year it was released 2022 the last number is the number of the set set 71003 the door in the back does open look at that that's pretty awesome it has a big trunk so you can put bad guys in there or if you can see in there you can have a character with his gun up criminal and boom there's a police officer pointing a rifle right at him let's come here to this side this is a sticker that shows some police lights this police here is not a sticker this is a permanent text here there's also the text police at the top of the truck and here at the very top there is the number 7103 that also represents the number of the set is just missing one one zero because it's seven one zero zero three they just went ahead and put seventy one zero three this also identifies seventy one as being the county of where the police is from and zero three is the number of the unit so this would be unit zero three tactical unit zero three from the police force another thing you can do here is remove the top and now you have a full access to the inside of the cabin and the back of the truck. A total of four police officers sitting in this car. I removed his helmet. He's driving this tactical truck. There is also a passenger side right there. I put the helmet in there. And on the back, two reverse seats that you can use it either for the criminals to be arrested and be put in there with handcuffs. Or you can have two more tactical units sitting in the back. Trunk area for accessories or more unit. It's up to you what you want to put in there. And here are some of the positions you can have your your officers not just driving or inside the cabin in the back you can stand in the back here there's a little platform 
just be wary if you drive he will fall there's no way to hold him there and the guy on the top here he can hold in this little rail so he's there for good look at that he can just be on top shooting people or doing whatever maneuver he wants to do what you can also do is have two extra characters holding on the side of the truck just like that there is a little handle in there and a platform so they do stay on that area and they don't fall no matter what their accessories will but not the character it looks absolutely awesome it's one of my favorites if not the most favorite police car i own in this set there aren't really any accessories for the truck there's just accessories for the character two handcuffs a radio two pistols two rifles gloves for each character a helmet for each character as well and a mask so these masks you can actually remove from their faces by just removing the hair you can see what the character looks like if maybe they had a beer hidden but he does not have a beer this is how their backs look like if you do get to remove their heads you can actually get the vests out as well but that's it that's the set here is the truck it's the best truck i have ever seen from playmobil unfortunately I guess they got run over and it's over for these two guys. It's the end of shift. I accidentally did not see they were standing in there and I moved the truck right on it.